Ladies, gentlemen, boys, girls, people of all ages, how are you guys doing today? My name is Blocks, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to download too many items for 1.7.5. Now, if you're curious on how to download it for all the younger versions, please don't forget there will be a link down in the description to download 1.7.4, 1.7.2, but any of the others. So, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download too many items, 1.7.5, in matter of quick easy time it's gonna take you no time at all and if you have any questions feel free to comment down in that description so first off the first thing you're gonna need is you're going to need winrar or 7-zip I do not actually have tutorials on how to get those so I'm sure you can find free ones up on the internet um, I'm not actually sure if they cost anything but I just like to get that out that's what you're gonna need you're gonna need winrar so, we are doing this on Windows 8, but it should work for any other browser or any other Windows operating system. So, let's begin the tutorial. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your internet browser, and in this case, go down to the description of the video, and type in the description is going to be a link. Follow that link, and it's going to take you to 1.7.5 non-forged version. Now, that's the one you're going to want to click on. So, once you've got that done, you can click, and then an ad fly is going to pop up. Now, there has been a bug where AdFly does not show up, this little counter right here. Do not worry about that. Um, I do not know how to fix that. It could be a bug with an AdFly. I would try some alternative location because I'm sure you can find the files upline somewhere. So, you're going to want to click Skip Ad and it's going to begin to download. Now, once you have that downloaded, drag that to your desktop and it's going to look something like this. We already have it downloaded, so we're just it's going to be on your desktop. Once you've got that done, you're going to want to open up your Minecraft, and you're going to wait, and wait. And then, it's going to say, right after it says starting launcher, it's going to say right down here, download and play Minecraft 1.7.5. Now that is not if you have not already played 1.7.5. So for some reason, if you're missing 1.7.5 on your where we get, this is what you're you're gonna want to have this download already. So we're gonna download the files really fast. It's just gonna take a quick second, and then we can exit out of it because we are good to go. So now that that is downloaded, you're gonna wait, and you're gonna have your Minecraft pop up. Now there's actually gonna be nothing here because you're on 1.7.5 without any too many items. What you're gonna want to do is open up your Minecraft or go down to your Run and type in percent app data percent. And you can click OK. Now there's going to be a dot Minecraft folder right here. Or there's another way. Somehow say that doesn't work. You can come over here to edit profile. And then it says open game directory. That is going to be the exact same files as before. So you can exit out of your Minecraft right now. And just have the dot Minecraft open. So once you go down, you can scroll down, and you're going to have all these files. Don't worry about any of these, because the only ones we're going to want to worry about is versions. So click on versions, and you're going to have these many versions. There's going to be a lot of these, but we're going to only want to worry about the 1.7.5. So once you've got that done, you can have, there's two options. You can duplicate this file if you're worried about it backing up, if you're worried about screwing something up in the process, or you can just do it right to this file. Now, at the end of the video, I'm going to show you guys how to work it back to where, if you only use it on this file, you can still get to 1.7.5, so you don't need a duplicate. But this is just if you want to just have one mod, too many items on it. So, what we're going to need is we're just going to do that. So, we're going to right-click, and it says Rename. Here, it's, you're going to go underscore, capital T-O-O, -O, many items, just like the one above. And you're going to want to copy all the way to the underscore so that all this is copied. The 1.7.5 underscore too many items and hit enter. Once you've that got that done, you have to change three other files. Now, here you're going to have it as a notepad, which is a JSON file. And you can go open with and then choose notepad, just like we have it. But we, it's already open with notepad for us. So here we're going to go and go to rename once again. And click in between so that it, you're not highlighting the whole thing. And go right-click, paste. So that says 1.7.5, too many items, JSON. 
and you're going to do that to the exact same thing to the top file so that it's a jar file. Now, you're going to want to make sure that that is a WinRAR file or a 7-zip file. So you can right click on the file and go open with WinRAR Archiver and click so that it opens up in WinRAR. But we are actually going to have, there's one more step. What you're going to want to do right now is open up your 1.7.5 JSON file. Now you're going to see a lot of these, a lot of this stuff that looks confusing. Actually, you're not going to want to worry about any of this except for this little bit right here up in the top left. It says 1.7.5 and in between the quotations, you're going to want to right click and go paste so that it says 1.7.5 too many items just like before. And then you're going to go file save and you can exit out of that. Now let's go and open up this as a WinRAR and we can open up the other file because we can exit out of the dot Minecraft. So we have this one and the downloaded both open. So we have two of the files open. Now on the one that says 1.7.5 too many items, you're going to want to go ahead and delete meta inf. This now what you're deleting right now is just a uh, this prevents you from adding mods to Minecraft. So while deleting this, it doesn't harm anything. If you want, you can leave it, but it's not going to work as well. So what you're going to do is just delete that and then you can add mods. So now that you've got that done, you're going to want to click on your too many items WinRAR file and go file select all so that all of this entire files are highlighted. And then you're going to drag it into the other side. And then this archiver name and parameters is going to open up. Just hit OK and you're going to be done. So now you should have the mod on your computer. So we're going to double check. We're going to open up Minecraft here. And then we're going to make sure that the mod actually downloaded and is successfully on our computer. So in the bottom right, it should now say ready to play Minecraft 1.7.5 too many items. And we're going to click play. So it's going to take a quick sec just to download it because you added a mod to your Minecraft. And once you're here, you can go into single player and go to whatever world. Now this only works for single player because due to multiplayer, you can be caught like cheating and stuff. So they don't want that. So it only works for single player right now. Now once in single player, you can go to your inventory and you should have the mod all open here. If you want, you can click O and O if you do not have it by clicking O, it will open up the too many items interface. Now, if you're not familiar with what too many items is, you can do a bunch of things by like changing your adventure mode, changing the time of day, the peaceful, the weather, or you can be adding items to your Minecraft. Now, that's going to be for a later tutorial, but I just wanted to show you guys that Minecraft 1.7.5 has opened up for too many items. Now that you've got that done, we're going to show you guys how to delete your Minecraft uh, 1.7.5 too many items. Say for some reason you no longer want it. This is I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Now the mod is act the tutorial is actually done here, but if you're curious on how to delete your mod, then this is going to be for you. So you're going to want to go back to open game directory or the run percent app data and you're going to want to go to Minecraft, which it already is, and then go down to versions and right click on the 1.7.5 too many items and click delete. Now, before you do that, you're going to want to exit out of both Minecraft files and you're going to want to empty your recycling bin after you delete it so that all files are deleted. Now, the only thing you have left is to open up your Minecraft and repeat the process by re-downloading 1.7.5. And that's exactly how you download and remove Minecraft Too Many Items mod for 1.7.5. I hope this has helped you guys tremendous. And if you would do me the favor and please leave a like for the video. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe because that means I did an awesome job by explaining this to you. And for some reason, say you're having a little trouble, don't forget to please comment down in the description because I will help you guys tremendously. So thank you guys for watching and I hope you have an amazing day. Please don't forget to wash your hands.